Welcome to West Pier Game. Today we have Wesleyan's men's captains, Zach and Glenn. Welcome back, you guys, from the hard winter training. How was, you know, getting through every single day in this cold weather? Yeah, it was definitely cold this, this winter break. Um, but over winter break, it's, it's, it's all basketball. There's no class or anything, so it was great to be able to focus in on basketball. It really brings the team together also. It's a lot of time, so we really just, like, have team dinners and different things like that, so it's enjoyable. And most of you guys, I mean, play because basketball is your passion, so not having school in the middle of it, you know, really makes you happy every day, I'm assuming, right? Absolutely. Definitely. Eat, eat sleep, and play basketball. Yes. <laughs> and before training, you guys had a wonderful season as well. Um, can you tell me about, you know, your thoughts on the previous season and the games, even yesterday, the Con College? Um, well, we've, you know, I think we're, we're one and three in, in NESCAC, so it was nice to get our first, our first win. <laughs> um, we had a couple games where we thought we thought we could um, grab the W, but but we didn't. And so it's it's kind of you know looking forward, but we're very excited about about the rest of the season. Definitely, we, as a team, we feel like every day we're getting better. So we're about to play our best basketball late in the season. Exactly. And the games leading up to the Con College one yesterday were pretty close. So what was it like, you know, finally getting that win yesterday? Oh yeah, that was that was huge. You know. We've, We've talked a lot about it. It's sort of yeah. we, we're a young team this year, um, and we've learned a lot. But we really need to learn how to finish games. Uh, that's something that we've talked a lot about. And so to to do that yesterday was was big for us. And is there anything in particular as captains that you stress to the younger players to finish out these games and make sure you know we get that win? Um, definitely as younger players, I don't think they really understand how how hard it is and how difficult it is to actually play a full complete game. And playing a perfect game is, I mean, it's almost impossible, but you definitely have to give your all for all the 40 minutes. And checking out your foot, I mean, I think you've played it all for these four years. Can you tell me about your little um, hiccup there? Yeah, I actually sprained my foot. It was uh, in the Middlebury game before the end of regulation. But hopefully I can come back soon, you know, get back to work. And as captains of the basketball team, this is your last year. Yeah. So is there anything you want to leave your team with or just something you want to do before you leave campus? Well, Glenn and I want to win a Nas uh, NESCAC championship. That boy, you know, it's, uh, that boy. it's something that we've, we've been striving for and we strive it for as a, as a program. And so if we can do that, that would be, that'd be ideal. Perfectly said. Perfectly said. Yeah. And what about any of the freshmen? Are there any that you want to leave lasting words with or? I mean, not really individually, just continue working hard. Exactly. Yeah. Get better every day. Exactly. And for the games to come, are there any that you're looking forward to in particular? Um, you know, we've always stressed that the most important game, no matter who's next, it's it's the next game. It's, it's the most important game of the season. So, uh, you know, right now we're just we're looking at Bates on, on Friday. And yep. that's, that's the most important game of the season right now. Yep, definitely. And there's many to come, so I hope you two both get to play before, you know, your senior year ends. Appreciate it. Thank yeah, you very thank much. You so much. Thank you so much for coming on to Last Career Game. Thank yeah. you. Thanks. Are there any questions you want me to ask you or anything you want to add in the interview? Um, no. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, nothing. Nothing? <laughs> nothing? Come on. Um. You know, Laura, what about you? Do you think we should add anything else? Um, no, I'm Instagramming you guys right now. <laughs> <laughs> so famous. Uh, no, I can't think of anything. Can you? Uh. Something interesting that you guys want to say. Oh yeah, we can talk about your, your, your uh, possible album release, you know. <laughs> well, <Yeah. laughs> <That's okay. laughs> um, do you have anything um, that you're working on? Right now, at the moment, just just anything. Yeah. Oh, like outside outside of basketball. Yeah. Not not, not really. No, <laughs> I'm just uh, trying to enjoy the, the second semester, final semester of of my college career. So I'm not really working on anything. Just relaxing. Exactly. Exactly. Any job searching? No, I, I have a job already, which 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 definitely takes a load off. What? Yeah, I'm doing enough job searching for the both of us right now. <laughs> but uh, I mean, I'm. I'm 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 almost pretty sad, so I'm not as worried as a lot of people are. What does that mean? Yeah. I mean, I, I have backups right now, but I haven't found exactly what I want. So, I should get peace of mind. Exactly. Yeah. And Zach, what are you going to be doing? I'm going to be working uh, at Morgan Stanley. 
Equity Research Department. Wow, wow. Yeah. New York City. It's like a perfect background right there. Four years at <laughs> Wesleyan, captain of basketball, then I'm going to work at Morgan Stanley. Uh, Are you excited? Are you excited? Yeah, I'm very excited. Very excited. Looking forward to it. And then, can you also tell me a little bit more about your album release that's possibly going to happen before this semester ends? Um, I mean, I've been, I've been dabbling with music for a very long time, so I have like a lot of like tracks that I've put out that I haven't really showed a lot of people. So I might just release all of these random tracks that I have and just make it a make it a free mixtape and just you know give it out. I don't really uh, want to give out the mixtape before I get a job though. So I'm not sure. That's why I'm still going back and forth. But you know, you have the audience here. We could all cheer for you while you're here. That's true. That's true. I mean, we'll see. It'll. Hopefully, everything will fall in place.